Today we tried to write Wilbur Sutt's new favorite song and he's here to rate our music. What's up Wilbur, how are you doing? Hi, I'm good, how are you? Excellent, because you're here, King. Okay. Didn't tell me it was going to be this guy. Not even mentioned. <laughs> Congratulations on your first gold single. Yay, it's out on Twitter. You. Yay. Yay. Yeah. But yeah, we want to ask you a few questions about your music taste and then we'll get cracking. When and where do you usually listen to music? Generally like commuting and like in the shower and gaming. Basically anywhere where my thoughts can get into my head so I can blast them out with sound. Are you okay? <laughs> Can you name three characteristics of the music you like the most? I like sort of herky-jerk, lots of abrupt stops and little weird rhythm patterns. And I also like dissonant chords and jazzier stuff. What makes a song terrible? Boring song, boring ideas. So like you can tell that it was made to be a song as opposed to make me feel something. No. I want to hear a story. I don't want to hear just, I woke up, I went to bed. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> also, if it's just predictable, there's no like texture, there's no change. I want to hear instruments coming in and out. In the middle eight, just do a complete like a samba rhythm, you know, just throw in <laughs> random stuff. What kind of lyrics do you like? Lyrics that make me go, huh, that's a fun lyric the first time I listen to it. But then every other time I'm like, yeah, that's normal. That's just part of the song. That's actually a pretty good description of a lot of your lyrics. Yeah, that's, that's the that's biggest that's compliment always... you could give me. That's what I aim to do. I also like lyrics that are just like so dumb that they come full circle and they become cool again. I'm looking forward to doing this. Okay, so we're back and we have one song each to play Wilbur and he will choose a winner. Who do you think will win? Just looking at us. I think you've got this, Jonas. You look like you're into math rock. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you enjoy your new favorite song. That riff is great. Stop, I can't believe what you're doing. Look at me with a face turning blue and I Start it sounds so good. Jonas' production is so much better than it used to be. We're trying to be a night. I wonder, is it enough with the reboot? Is it time that we uninstall? Is it of the peripherals? Or are we just incompatible? If we uninstall. had like some folk vibes in it, which I quite enjoyed, mm. but it was still like really electronic. It was cool. I really liked the um, riff as well. That was very nice of Wilbur. That was terrible, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> I wanted to write about a failing relationship, you know, make it sad, but using the terminology of a guy getting the blue screen of death, you can relate if you're sad because of a relationship or because you're just trying to get an epic gaming session and it's just not working for you. <laughs> That's good. I really like that. I absolutely love the sort of tappy guitar sounding riff and the rhythm over the entire Versus, I was trying to bob my head and I kept missing. <laughs> <laughs> the problem I had with it was that the chorus felt a little safe. It was a bit disappointing because it was such a hectic and weird song. And then it came into this nice, slow, flowing, lighters in the air chorus. And I was like, oh, I would have liked for you to go into some crazy stuff for the chorus because I was already enjoying the craziness in the verse. It's almost as if I ran out of time there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't because I hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I love the and my just the indie vibe. Told me I could improve my sleep if I wear my mouth guard. I don't because I hate myself. I clench my jaw. And as heck. Yes, I hate myself. Yes, I hate myself. Very nice. <laughs>
But up, but up, but up. That is going to be stuck in my head all day. And that's what. <laughs> that's exactly what I want. I thought you wanted complicated math, Rob. Oh, I want both. <laughs> you mentioned that predictability and boring lyrics were two things that you actually despise. That's why I decided to not rhyme at all in my verses. Oh, oh that's okay. why it sucked. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> the catchy ba ba buzz were absolutely perfect. I listen to a lot of Los Campesinos. So that's where I get most of my taste in those kind of jingly hooks. I love how you pulled in and out instruments and the way the drums transition the tones. I just felt like it needed some grit. Just slam on a fuzz pedal on those guitars or something, you know, make <laughs> it really hairy and gritty. That would have really worked. So my song is about being places and doing things I used to do with your ex. I think of you and I eat spicy tofu. So someone wear a t-shirt that you had. I sit alone at restaurants we used to go to. Fun little skip I'm there. I'm busy or I'll be too sad. You're out there drinking, you move on fast, huh? My heart is sinking, it can rub past her. <laughs> your friends are your dad. Wasn't pasta. It was his neck. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you really let into the humorist with the lyrics. That was, that was good. This is from a breakup I had once where I developed this weird coping habit of eating raw pasta. <laughs> it makes your stomach really upset. It's pretty bad for you. Why did you do it enough for it to develop into a habit yeah, then? I've eaten raw pasta <laughs> and I've never had a problem. I don't know how much <laughs> you eat. You gotta eat more. To record the eating raw pasta sounds, I opened a new one and it's out now because I had to do it so many times. I was sitting here like, so now I'm just gonna eat these again. I'm, I'm just gonna keep it. <laughs> I absolutely loved the rhythm. And I also enjoyed the way that your vocals stayed in 4-4 and just didn't change <laughs> over the top. So you were actually singing off beat for the second half of the verse, which I really enjoyed. <laughs> Definitely this blown away standaway part is the chorus. The only problem I had with it, it felt a little bit Backstreet Boys with that cool oh! response. The cool and response was a little bit not my vibe. Now I get down to some I want it that way, but, but that I've got to be in a certain mood. You can get down to some I want it that way, but that doesn't mean that you actually want it that way. Oh. Uh. So Wilbur, which song is your new favorite song? My new favorite song would have to go to Eating Raw Pasta by Rune. Oh! Just oh, for that chorus. Just for that oh chorus. I wish I thought of this first. Suck it, boys. Whatever. That's just your opinion, Wilbur. Okay, thank you, Wilbur, for joining us. Where can people find you? If they want to watch Minecraft, they can put Wilbur Soot in Twitch or YouTube. And if they want to listen to indie rock music, they can search Lovejoy on everything. Woo. Hey, the video's over. Click this one. Bye.